in terms of getting an idea of the player's mindset. They have personalities state. too. We get to see so much of the player's yeah. personality. You know, uh, uh, there are certain top players that right. we see all the time on stream, and we have no clue what they actually sound like in real life with their voices. I, I still don't know what Leo sounds like. <laughs> So we got oh. Corrin here. Corrin? Yeah, so I lied when I said he it's was okay. Corrin, the, the breadwinner of a couple of nice little buffs. Honestly, with the more and more I've been seeing this character, she she's becoming more and more legitimate by the day. She's still a little lackluster, but I think she really, really rewards just a solid fundamental player. Yeah, she doesn't quite have the same uh, <laughs> absurdism that she used to. Oh, yeah, for sure. But uh, no, the character is still super solid for juggling, which in this matchup in particular is definitely going to be relevant. We've already seen that a majority of the 91% that Player 4 has taken has been from those just being put above uh, Vice and Vice just keeping him there. But it's pretty even right now, actually. I was going to say, Re Reggie as a player, uh, he will dan he will do a dance with you in neutral, and his micro-spacing is honestly fantastic. He will make you feel dumb for throwing out a move where you think it'll hit, but then it'll miss him by, like, mere centimeters, and he'll try to space you out perfectly for either a bear or, or a fair. One, one thing he's been doing a lot is these Peach Bombers in the corner, and I feel like he's had such good command of the corner. Either he's waiting for a shield poke when Vice drops shield, or, or he's just waiting for, like, or, or he's just Hail Marrying that. Maybe he's just hair marrying that move. <laughs> I mean, he's also doing it in a spacing where he winds up off stage after the fact. So it's a little bit less punishable than maybe other situations. Ooh, no. <laughs> Actually, th wait, hold on. Was it the hit lag from the projectile that kept that move from connecting? I don't know what happened. I thought player four was shielding, but maybe not. No, he was doing a back air, and I think oh. the back air hit the energy ball, clanked with it, did the little clank, which meant that uh, he was frozen in place enough for the bite that to That might connect. have been it. Because I know the more powerful the move you clank, uh, the more recoil you'll have after the clank. Uh, either way, Vice looking pretty good with this Corn right now. Uh, it can be a little kind of scary for Peach because although uh, Corn's not the first character you think to mind when you think of Strong Sortie, her range really allows her to play and, and box with Peach in neutral quite a bit. Ooh, but we got, a nice, we got the Reggie combos on deck. Oh, boy. Yeah. Pretty even game at this point, although... Oh, I, it's hard to say which one of these characters kills earlier because both of them can at times struggle to end stocks even though like you wouldn't think so from Corrin but just because of the speed of the character uh, sometimes like can't quite be where she needs to in order to you know get a super good conversion in neutral. I can agree with that her big winning moves are probably bear uh, pin can kill pretty reliably as well honestly though all of Peach's aerials if sweet spotted can do devastating amounts is that a stock? Yeah, that's going to be it. Not enough uh, drift after the initial uh, hit of the upbeat. Player 4 is going to be taking a little bit of a lead. And if I know Reggie, he's going he's going in campo mode right now. My uh, man, my man really? Is, yeah, he's going to wait for you to uh, whiff on him. He's going to blow you up for it real nicely. See, all, all of these attempts from Vice to just bring this game back, and Reggie is just playing out of shield so well, getting these nice little uh, peach B&Bs off of down throw. Recognizing that Vice has been going through a lot of aggressive options to get out of disadvantage, and... Uh, for Corrin, with like miss space, if you know your opponent's gonna miss space with like a downer or something, yeah, just hold shield and do what you gotta do after the fact. But oh, was I gonna break? Oh, okay. I think I'm just gonna assume Reggie SDI there. So yeah, in, oh, in that yeah, situation, definitely. if you are against the Corrin uh, F smash, if they like to hold it for a little too long, just SDI up and just press air dodge. You'll get out of it most of the time, and Corrin will have too much end leg to really punish you after it. But at the same time, if you are the Corrin, as soon as you see them in the uh, in the chainsaw, you might as well just let it rip because mm -hmm. Peach was dead at that. Oh, right? yeah, for sure. Absolutely. If that, if that fully connected, I think Reggie would have been toast. Either way, though, Vice looking at a very scary spot. It's always scary when Player 4 has you in the corner just because he's so oppressive and his movement can be very, very daunting. Peach can really do a lot out of her movement super duper quickly. Not only that, but the Peach, when you are in the corner, that is when Peach has had her most threatening because sometimes she can struggle to kill from mid stage. But in the corner, Ooh. back airs, that sort of thing, that'll absolutely put you in the <laughs> <We ground. ain't laughs> That was some Bermuda Triangle DI right there. <laughs> My man, my man took the stick off his controller for the <laughs> TI. <laughs> that was a rough one. Um, I think Vice played that pretty well. He started to get a little antsy towards the end there, and I feel like against Reggie, it, it's it's like a war of attrition, honestly. He just wears you down and sees how impatient you can get in neutral because he has those fat punishes ready at his disposal. You know, he's yeah. not afraid to just wait wait for you to come to him. Even, even if it looks like he's super active with his movement, like mo he's not really looking to commit to a, an attack option. He's looking for you to commit to one, and then he'll blow you up for it with his movement. Yeah. Hey, can you also add uh, Grunt to that, too, if that'll fit at all? I know I'm asking. <laughs> no, I'm asking a, little, a lot. I understand. If you don't want to do it, you can just literally put no in my name as well if you don't feel like doing that. 
<laughs> just have it be grunt revenant <laughs> slash nothing. Um, it's too much. I gotta keep repping grunt though. They're also <laughs> they're beautiful, beautiful. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, no, I didn't mean that. No, no, no. Keep it. Keep it. I, I meant put no if you didn't want to do it. <laughs> Oh, All right. Okay. Up. So, uh, help me remember the the sort of the state of that game. Game stock one. Uh, Vice was looking good. Vice took first, right? Uh, he took the first stock with. Um the neutral B. That's right. And as soon as Reggie took the first stock, that's when all of a sudden it, it just escalated and went yeah, yeah, yeah. away from him. So <laughs> it's the. <s> <laughs> <laughs> He's feeling himself. I Aaron didn't catch that, but uh, Reggie's vibing out probably to Kanye or maybe Doja Cat. I know Doja Cat <laughs> just dropped a new album. By the way, if you if you like Doja Cat, check out her new album. It's fantastic. Reggie's making eye contact with the camera, and it's making me deeply uncomfortable. He's feeling himself. <laughs> I'm here for it. I'm here for it. <laughs> Yeah, you don't understand. I see Reggie at tournaments. He looks like he wants to die most of the time. <laughs> he, look, he looks like the most depressed person ever. Like he's like, I don't know if I'll do well. He misinputs one thing, but he's happy. This is a this is a player four we haven't seen before. Player four with emotion, passion, and happiness, and just vibing. Well, that's um, hopefully it's not a mistake. We if if he does it, if he loses this set after being happy, we might never see happiness <laughs> ever yeah. again. Ooh. <laughs> he is. He's vibing. J yeah, vibing and jiving right now. Vi vibe central, player four. Yeah, he's feeling it. And if, I, if I'm Vice, I'm, I'm going to be a lot more cognizant of my spacing because he got blown up for that really, really hard just for every... Like, that that poke with the down air that player four did was fantastic to just convert into that stock because... Yeah, yeah that was a down air two frame at yeah, the ledge, right? it was really good. Yeah, down so air, a fantastic two framing tool in this game. Yeah, and it's also like Peach can kind of float there, so mixing up your timing might not even necessarily help you out that much. Ooh. Vice, again. All right, good. Vi Vice is doing, I think, what he needs to do with this character, which is just wait in place. Like, Korn is Korn's approach options, like, a lot of her options aren't typically too safe on shield unless she spaces them, like, super perfectly. So I feel like Vice would be better off most of the time to just hold hold mid-stage and just wait for player four to enter kind of the, the danger zone because Korn, Korn can get a lot of uh, stuff off of her straight hits. Until, like, yeah, at yeah. the same time, if he's too non-aggressive, player four can start farming those turnips yeah. and get, get a... You know, one of the high impact ones. He doesn't traditionally do that, uh, but I think it's it's definitely an active threat that Vice has to deal with because Peach does have you know that as a potential zoning tool, or just even Peach's waiting game is also good too. Player four doesn't mind running the clock. I know I'm talking a lot about player four, but he's my best friend on stream, man. I don't I don't I know enough about Vice. All I know is that Ooh. Vice kind of getting slopped up right now by player four. These, these these kills are so consistent on player four's part, and he's really catching Corrin's lackluster linear recovery really, really well. Yeah, not only that, but remember how that game won? There were these huge juggles. Ooh. Not really seeing that. Now we're starting mm. to see that happen just a little bit here, but for the most part, player four has been retreating to ledge and getting off of ledge pretty dang easily. This becomes the hard part, too, because it, it, it Corrin has to be able to keep up or at least contest Peach when uh, Peach is within her airspace, and I think she can do that. It's just that... Player 4 has been kind of just mixing up the movement, getting a lot more also uh, benefit off of these interactions. That was so close. Oh, 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 the, the grab just whiffed? <laughs> I guess the <laughs> tiny little bit of leaning that forward. Crazy. Ooh, that's going to be good. Hold Vice on needs to hit second. those. those yeah, that was, yeah, that was huge. That's the second back air he's taken at a lower percent. And this is completely doable for Vice. Still not a great position. He is at 88, trapped oh, at the corner, yeah. getting forward air. <sighs> this is getting the thing. Oh, that's, that's it. it. Yeah. No. That's what I would say. The back air. Nice. Good saving jump on Vice's part. I cannot. Yeah, every counter in this game is stupidly active for way longer than it actually looks like it is. And yet down smash somehow less active than counter. <laughs> yeah. All right, though. Vice starting to make little strides here. Player four getting a little complacent with these approaches. All right. Going to be oh. living. Excellent platform to save. Yeah, especially because he had to burn Ooh. his jump. Oh, that eye is going to be closing it out. <laughs> <And that's> <laughs> <laughs> Is he player four at the player cam? He's feeling it. Uh, uh